Currently, we're building a school in San Quentin prison and changing the lives of inmates. Outside the bars, manufacturing is also giving opportunities to those that need it. I gotta go down to Workshop for Warriors, training up our vets, the men and women that have fought for our country and our freedom, and lifting up the American workforce. My name is Hernan Luisi Prado. I'm the founder and CEO of Workshops for Warriors. I'm a U.S. Navy combat veteran with tours in Afghanistan and Iraq. I'd come back from my first combat tour in Iraq. I'm in this mall with my wife, Rachel, and this guy comes up to me and says, hey, Doc, how are you? And Hernan was like, oh, wow. And they exchanged pleasantries, and then John asked Hernan, to be his best man. This was a guy in his unit. He'd just seen him and they had been on tour together and this young kid is about to get married and he doesn't have a leg and a foot. And it was like, I think the last draw for him. What is this guy's future gonna be like? What are all of these people gonna do? How is this affecting this generation of veterans? Then they kind of parted ways and then Hernan turned and kind of pulled me. We were standing right outside of a bookstore. He pulled me into the bookstore and he lost it. Like he, I've never seen him break down. I was clutched onto my wife Rachel's arm and said, you know what, we're, we're gonna sell everything that we have and we're gonna change this. And, and to my wife's credit, she said, yes, we are. Titan. Thank you so much for having me. I hear you guys are doing amazing things. Well, I'm pretty happy about what you're doing as well. It's great Ooh. to see America back on top again, right? It's about promoting American manufacturing, job growth, and what you're doing here to train up our veterans. It's my honor to be here. Workshops for Warriors is the only accredited school in the nation that trains, certifies, and places veterans, wounded warriors, and transitioning service members into advanced manufacturing careers. So imagine this great pool of talent, and we're gonna train them, certify them, and place them into the most advanced manufacturing careers in the world so that America can regain her role as the world's manufacturing superpower. I just got chills, man. Yeah, man. That's how the... we're gonna do it, man. Oh, thank you so much, man. I'm excited. So I see some hot CNC machines, the American flag. Yeah. You show me around? Absolutely, come awesome. on back. So we've developed a social enterprise called Vet Powered, and that does two things. So this is a Department of Labor certified apprenticeship program. And this is where we teach the best of the best. So in the military, we say you crawl. It you provides crawl. a great training opportunity for our Department of Labor Certified Apprenticeship Program. And secondly, it provides a great opportunity for the best of the best to continue their training so that they can later on become instructors to help teach at workshops for warriors. Workshops for Warriors provides life-changing training and nationally recognized certifications they're using tomorrow's technology today to gear up for their lifelong career. So how long have you been uh, machining? Uh, about 15 years as a machinist. Okay. So you, he actually works here and actually makes products. Make products and teach the students how to do this. You're making real parts. We're trying to. Yeah. <laughs> so what happens if the flow of goods, materials, and tools stop? How does America rebuild herself? Right now there's 2.3 million unfilled jobs in manufacturing. 40% of the workforce is re gonna retire in the next four years. There's a need to develop the workforce yeah, to fill those positions. Thanks for your service. So we have the largest and newest press brakes and shears in SoCal right now, from 400 ton press brakes all the way up to the newest technology in the world, eight axis, high precision Amada press brakes and a million dollar CNC laser, a model laser with a shuttle table. Need a water jet, laser, press breaking, CNC machining, welding. And plasma, high definition plasma over in the corner. So you can, you can say all you want, but if you teach people how to use a tinker toy, they're gonna know how to use a tinker toy. If you teach them how to use the best equipment in the world, and they leave there with credentials that nobody can touch. What if learning CNC didn't have to be so difficult? 
Jacob. What if you could instantly get an answer to any question about CAD CAM and CNC? What if technology allowed you to go from an idea to a finished part all before lunch? What if one new idea, one new technique could change the future of your entire shop? And what if all of this was available for free to anyone, anywhere, online? Thousands of projects, prints, setup sheets, and downloadable files, video tutorials, inspiration, and much more. Take your CAD CAM and CNC abilities to another level. Welcome to Titans of CNC Academy. Boom! Good morning, gentlemen. I want to introduce you to a guest, and we're going to show them how we're rebuilding America's advanced manufacturing workforce one vet at a time. Tight. How's everybody doing? Good. Thank you guys so much for having me. Thank you so much for just the incredible service to our, our great country. And I'm humbled to just be standing right here and uh, seeing you guys like on the computers, building products, you know, getting ready to go on the CNC machines and uh, do America proud, you know, once again. What I love about Marines especially is that they take no BS from anyone. Like they're just relentless and they're moving forward. No matter what happens, like you yeah. can't stop them down. You know, we get all this great training to become a Marine yeah. and then all these follow-on schools and within the Marine Corps. Then you get out, you get about a week to transition to become a civilian. So all we're doing is we're providing the same high level of training that the Marine Corps and Department of Defense provides and giving them the nationally recognized credentials at the end of it or the opportunity to earn them. And just like the Marine Corps, right, the school is a filter, it's not a pump, but the people that make it through here get jobs and they are lifelong advocates for advanced manufacturing and they're helping to rebuild America. Thank you for your service, man. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. How many of you guys have manufacturing experience before you got here? So this is a new thing for you guys, right? And you guys are thinking about like your future and how much money you're gonna make, right? Thank you, thank you. Manufacturing is at a place right now where it's an exciting place. Not only does it give opportunity to those that need it the most, but it is a year round job that, that enables you to put your kids through college, enables you to you know, have that car and have that house while making parts for amazing companies. Being in the Marine Corps, getting ready to transition out, you kind of come to this realization that what I've been doing for the last four years isn't gonna apply in the civilian world. When the students come here, we tell them that there's a 94% retention rate for jobs after they graduate. They get out knowing that they're going to get a job, knowing that they're going to be able to stay in that job for a really long time. It really helps kickstart them and motivates them, and that's what carries them through the program. Come on in, please. These are the best machines out there, right? These Haas machines, mills and lathes. portion of our Haas Technical Education Center. So what are you gonna make today? Uh, today we're just cutting a practice part that we did. This is actually my code that I wrote myself. We write our own programs by hand and to be able to go on a computer and you'll write a code with up to 500 lines in it, it has to be perfect. And then go on a machine and cut out a part and it's within tolerance by a thou. It's just a tremendous feeling when you finally get it done. These are some of the parts, for example, they've got to make in mill and lathe. So they go from art to part in 16 different parts in 16 weeks. They understand like every facet of manufacturing. By doing this course, I realized how powerful CNC machining really is. I can confidently say that I can walk out of here and get any job anywhere in America using those certifications as a machinist. He's gonna give you the skills. The military gave you the right attitude. 
And when you keep building upon that, you will be successful in this trade. You can make really good money, but you have to solve problems. Workshops for Warriors has more welding booths than the Navy, Marine Corps, and NASCO combined on the West Coast. We teach every type of welding known to man. MIG, TIG, STIG, oxyacetylene, silver soldering, brazing, underwater welding. Wow. So these guys and gals leave here not only with credentials, but tangible, hands-on experience. This program is it's unreal. There's nothing like it in the world. I got all these credentials and, and qualifications in just a year. If I were to try to do this outside, it would have took me easily four years to get everything that I have right now. These guys are the foundation of this country. Absolutely. And just because they're not serving overseas for us or in the military actively, they're still serving by building products. You get out of the service, you take off your uniform, and you trade in your machine gun for a micrometer, Ooh. and you serve again in America's manufacturing force. Sure. You guys are like providing a way for our vets to come back and actually learn manufacturing. Oh, yeah. And I just like, I'm excited to see where your program goes and how it grows, because we need this to happen in every single state. These great men and women of the armed forces have gone over and fought for our freedom. I want people to look 150 years from now yeah. and say, oh wow, workshops for warriors in San Diego, the birthplace of America's green manufacturing renaissance. And we're gonna do it with these vets right here. That's it, man. Yeah. You guys are already doing it. We're pretty, we're pretty excited amazing. to move forward. You know? That's amazing. Cool, man. We're going to create a national workforce, a national advanced manufacturing workforce, one vet at a time.